Hi there, and as we get through the most depressing part of the year, here's a reminder to keep your chin up and let's give you some games to play whilst we all get through the sulking season. I'm Mihin Kasor, and here are 5 games you might have missed this week on Steam. Fierce to fathom Carson House lulls you in with a nostalgic VHS film aesthetic, but don't let that put you at ease, as this game is primarily a horror. The third game in the Fierce to Fathom anthology sees you play as an 18-year-old Noah Baker, house-sitting for a media personality. That's a horror in itself, I can't think of anything worse than people who make videos for a living. Ugh. As if that wasn't scary enough, its photorealistic graphics and eerie lonesome vibe really helped make this the traumatic house sitting from hell. Although you can pet a dog in it, so I guess it can't be that bad. Ugh, landlords, am I right? Luck Be A Landlord is a fun roguelike deck builder about using a slot machine to earn rent money and defeat capitalism. Even Magic the Gathering creator Richard Garfield calls it wacky fun and worth playing. So what's better than adding to the crippling anxiety of the current housing crisis and the upcoming Blue Monday than gambling your life away to pay for rent? Although, yet again, you can pet a dog in this game, so I guess all is forgiven. Well, this one's pretty self-explanatory. In this free-to-play game, you race up to 15 other gumballs in procedurally generated PvP action to be the number one gumball in the Gumbiverse! Personally customize every single part of your gumball like their head, the eyes, the legs, and, well, that's pretty much it. It's a gumball. And as great as this game seems, there's in fact no dog patting in this game, but it's still worth your time. As if the January blues didn't hit us hard enough already. And for some reason, you want to suck the fun and joy out of your day even more. Here's Escape Jump, the precision platformer that will have you falling from grace, sanity, and however high you get in its only upward scrolling levels. Escape the damn tower with each platform carefully designed to extract as much suffering as possible from the soul of players. Two different very difficult difficulties in which you'll fall in, and if this all sounds great to you, then I'm sure you'll fall in love with Escape Jump. Get ready to feel a little by furious with a game that's been stuck in limbo for a while now but has finally come to steam. Experience everything that made the story of Scott Pilgrim vs the world so epic like the over-the-top characters and cartoony art style of the comic books. As you can see, it's a side-scrolling beat-em-up. And with this being the complete edition, it includes DLC characters Knives Chow and Wallace Wells. So now, fall in lesbians with this cult classic story. And that's all we got for you this week. I hope you managed to stay sane in this weird, gloomy period. And I'm Mihin Kasor, and remember to like, comment, and subscribe to PC Gamer's YouTube channel. See ya!